The opposition is gunning to take over the state governments of Pera and Trenganu via crossover, says Tun Dr. Mahathir Mohamed. The party pre Bumi Bersatu Malaysia chairman and former Prime Minister said that these states only needed two assemblymen from each state to cross over. He was referring to Jora Assemblyman Datuk Dr. Shahruddin Saleh's crossover from Amno to Pribumi that resulted in Johor Barisan losing its two thirds majority in the state government. Datuk, do you expect more crossovers in Johor? Uh, to be frank with you, I don't think so at the moment. Eh? So there is no rumours of. Uh, maybe you may hear here and there that people might cross over. I mean, um, uh, all my fellow friends. I don't think so at the moment. Uh, to be truth about things, you know. Uh. You're not like courting anybody. You know? No, no, no. I'm not there to persuade them, you know, uh, to to uh, like uh, talking something uh, like uh, we invite them to join uh, to join me. I will then just leave it to them to decide what they want to do. Following Dr. Shahruddin's appointment as Pribumi Secretary General, Johor Amno Secretary Datu Muhammad Jais Sardi announced that his membership had been revoked. Muhammad Jais also dismissed the opposition's claims that Barisan had lost two-thirds majority in the State Assembly following Dr. Shahruddin's announcement. He stressed that with the defection of Dr. Shahruddin to Pribumi, the party had gained one seat while Pakatan had 18 and Barisan still had two-thirds majority in the Johor State Assembly. Muhammad Jais, who is also a state exco member, also rubbish opposition's claims that more Johor AMNO members would jump ship to Pribumi.